updating Node.js and NPM on Mac. Before we begin the update, let's first check the versions that we currently have for Node and NPM. Let's open up our terminal by pressing Command Space and then Terminal or TR. Let's first check the version of our Node.js by typing node minus v. This minus v flag will show us the version of our node. So here, just press enter. And as you can see, we have version 4.5. Let's now check the version of our node package manager, or npm. Here, just type npm minus v. And we currently have version 4.0.3. After the upgrade, we expect that these version numbers will be properly updated to the newer versions. Let's first start with Node.js. To upgrade to the latest version of Node, you just simply need to do these steps. Open up a new terminal window by typing command N. Second, log in as root or as your computer's administrator by typing sudo i. And then just enter your root password once prompted. So here you just type sudo i. And then for your password, Third, you have to clean up your npm cache to remove any previous reference to the old node version. Just type npm cache clean then minus f. Now, we're ready to get the latest node.js version and update our system. Just type npm install minus g n. This command basically tells npm to get the latest version of node, which is what the letter n stands for. And then it installs a new version as a global package, which is what the minus G or the global mode represents. All right, just type npm install minus G and then N. And as you can see here, the npm installs the new version of Node.js in this directory. And then lastly, type N stable to get the latest stable version of Node.js. And then wait for it to complete. And it's done. We had successfully upgraded Node.js. Let's move on and update our Node Package Manager. To do this, just open up another terminal window or just use this current one that we're using. But for the sake of our demo, we'll just open up another window instead. So just press Command N for a new window. And then log in as root by just typing sudo i. And then just enter your password. Updating our Node Package Manager is actually more simple than updating Node.js. This time, we only need to issue one command, and that is npm install minus g and then npm. This command is similar to what we used to update Node.js. The minus g flag means that we are using the global mode to install the new version of npm as a global package. And the last parameter in the command, npm, is the actual application that we are updating. Again, just don't forget to add the minus g flag because if you don't do this, then npm will just install the latest version on the local directory only that you're currently on. All right, so going back, just run the npm install minus g npm command. Just press enter. And then wait for the update to complete. And it's done. NPM is now properly updated. Let's now check the current versions of our Node.js and Node Package Manager. A while ago, we issued this node-v and npm-v commands. So before, we have node version 4.5 and then npm version 4.0.3. Let's now check our versions. So here, let's open another terminal window and then type node minus v and then npm minus v and look our node.js version is now 7.4 and for npm 
It is version 4.1.1. Node and NPM are rapidly evolving technologies, so there are a lot of updates going on. Usually, NPM is more frequently updated than Node, so you should always get the latest version of it every now and then. 